Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. I am Lalita and hearty welcome to my YouTube channel VBackers. In this video, we will discuss about square root of non-perfect square numbers which are having 6 digits. Video of square root for perfect square numbers and non-perfect square numbers of 2 digits have already been posted. If you have any doubt, you can write or you can ask the question in the comment section. So let us start the video without wasting the time. Now find the square root of 8239. So from right hand side you have to make the pair. So pair 39 and 82. We have to see which square number is nearest to 82. I think that is 81. And square root of 81 is 9. So we can divide 82 by 9. So 82 minus 81, 1. And drop down 39. Next pair. So 139. Now double of 9, that is 18. Now we have to see how many times will it go in 139. I don't think... 139 can be divided by because we have to write any one number here one digit here one digit here so it's not possible you can divide 139 by 18 and one blank is there so it will not be divisible so you insert 0 here 0 here so 180 Times 0 is 0. So 139 minus 0 is equal to 139. Now there is no digit. So you have to insert decimal. And write double 0. And 180 because a double of 0 is 0 only. Now one blank is there. By which number it is divisible? I think by 7. So 1807 should be multiplied by 7. Your answer will become 12649. Now find the difference. That is 1251. Now write next pair of 0. And double of 7 is 14. Add to 180. That will become 1814. And there is one space again and see how many times will it go will it go it will go six times now multiply 18,146 by 6 it will become 1,8876 8, find the difference it will be 16,224 so your answer is 90.76 let us go to next sum. Find the square root of 12,376. Again start making pair from right hand side that is 76. This is 23. Now 1 is left so we will take 1 first. 1 is a square root of 1. So you, we can divide by 1. So 1 minus 1 is 0, drop down next pair, that is 23, double of 1 is 2. Now there is a space, how many times will it go? I think it is 1 time. So 21 ones are 21, 23 minus 21 is equal to 2, drop down next pair, so that is 76. 21 double plus double of 1 is 1. That will become 22. Again there is a space. By which number we have to multiply. I think it is again will go in 1 time. So 221 times 1 is equal to 221. Find the difference. That is 55. Now there is no further digits. You have to insert decimal. And two zeros here, two zeros here. Then C, 221 plus double of 1 is 2. 
that is 222 again there is a space by which number we have to multiply by 2 so it will become 4444 find the difference that is 1056 insert pair of zeros and double of 2 will be added to 2222 So two thousand two hundred twenty-four, and see there is a space by which number we have to multiply. That is four. So it will become eighty-eight thousand eight hundred seventy-six. Find the difference. That will be sixteen thousand seven hundred twenty-four. So your answer is one thousand one hundred. Eleven point two four. Let us go to next sum. Find the square root of two lakh sixty five thousand four hundred eighty seven. Same way, start making pairs. Eighty seven, fifty four, one twenty six. Now, which square number is nearer to twenty six? That is five. So five fives are twenty fives. Find the difference. That is one. Drop down next pair. That is fifty four. Double of five is ten. Now again, by which number we have to multiply? I think it will go one time only. So write one, one here, and one hundred one ones are one hundred one. Find the difference. That is fifty three. Drop down next pair that is eighty seven. So one hundred one plus one is equal to one hundred two. And again there is a space by which number we have to multiply by five. So one thousand twenty five times five is five thousand one hundred twenty five. Find the difference. That is two hundred sixty two. So there is no digit further. So we have to insert decimal. And see by how many times we have to divide. So one thousand twenty-five plus five is equal to one thousand thirty, and it is space is there. We have to insert two here because it is divisible by two only. So answer will become twenty thousand six hundred four, and difference is five thousand five hundred ninety six. Insert pair of zeros. So one ten thousand three hundred two plus two is equal to ten thousand three hundred four, and space is there. By which number we have to multiply? I think it is five times. So multiply ten one lakh three thousand forty five by five. That is five lakhs fifteen thousand two hundred twenty five. Find the difference. That is forty four thousand three hundred seventy five. And your answer is five hundred fifteen point two five. Let us go to next sum. Find the square root of three lakh seventy eight thousand nine hundred forty two. Again, start making pair. Why pair? Because we are finding out square root. Now, thirty-seven is nearer to thirty-six, so we can divide by six. Six six are thirty-six. Find the difference. That is one. Drop down next pair. One eighty-nine. Double of six is twelve. And space is there. By which number we have to multiply? I think it is one time only. So one hundred twenty-one. Find the difference. That is sixty-eight. Drop down next pair. That is forty-two. One hundred twenty-one plus one. That is one hundred twenty-two. Space is there. By which number we have to multiply? Twelve fives are sixty. Five times. So. One thousand two hundred twenty-five times five is equal to six thousand one hundred twenty-five. Find the difference. That is seven hundred seventeen. Now there is no digit. 
further so we will insert decimal insert two zeros here also and see 1225 plus 5 that will become 1230 space is there we have to see how many times will it go let us try it is again will go for 5 times because 12 fives are 60 so multiply 12,305 by 5 that is 61,525 find the difference that is 10,175 insert pair of zeros again add 5 to 12,305 that will become 12,310 and see by which number will it go I think by 8 so multiply 1,23,108 by 8 that is 9,84,864 9, find the difference that is 32,636 and your answer is 615.58 now this is last sum find the square root of 8,29,698 again start making pairs 82 is nearer to 81 so we can divide by 9 9 times 9 is 81 1 drop down next pair that is 96 double of 9 is 18 and space is there how many times I think it will go one time only so write 181 find the difference that is 15 drop down next pair that is 98 181 plus 1 is equal to 182 again space is there how many times will it go I think it is not divisible so we will insert 0 next find the difference 1598 so there is no further digit insert decimal insert pair of zeros then 182 1820 plus 0 is equal to 1820 and space is there by which number it will go it will go 8 times so multiply 18208 by 8 it will become 1,45,664 find the difference 14,136 insert zeros and add 8 to 18,208 that will become 18,216 there is a space how many times will it go it will go for 7 times so multiply 1,82,100 167 by 7 that is 12,75,169 find the difference that is 1,35,431 so your answer is 910.87 now there is a homework find the square root of 6,73,248 and second sum 7,32,376 and you can write the answer in that comment section. I hope you have liked the videos. Thanks for watching the video. If you have liked then please do not forget to share, like, comment and subscribe. Have a nice day.